So I'm gonna demonstrate the comb and twist method. The easiest way is to first get your sections. So first I'm gonna grab some water. And once my section is saturated, I'm gonna grab my product, which is my locking gel. I'm gonna use my fingertips to go from the roots all the way to the end. I'm gonna do a comb through. And I'm not gonna use a wide tooth comb and I'm not, and I'm not gonna use the small teeth just yet. So I wanna be sure I comb all the way through it. I'm gonna start at the root. I'm gonna insert my comb. And as the comb goes in, I'm gonna start twisting. So I'm gonna be, I'm gonna twist and pull down, twist and pull down. There's a lot of different size combs you can use to do this. I prefer an all-purpose comb. That's one with both sides, um, two, two different size teeth. And as you get to the end, pull it all the way through and make sure that end is tucked in tight so it can curl up on its own. I'm gonna do another section. I take the small side of my comb. I'm gonna turn and twist. Turn and twist. And once you start doing it, you really won't pay attention to how much you're turning and twisting. It'll all be one full motion. So once I actually do the comb twist from the roots to the end, I may go back and add just a little bit more gel to the root and kind of give it a final twist. And that just adds a little bit more stiffness, a little more staying power because she has to get under the, under the dryer. And that is how you do a comb twist. <laughs>